The following episode contains strong language, baby boomer grumpiness and millennial entitlement. Top End Wedding is a unique blackfella rom-com set in the NT. The location of the NT is so important to the visual and aesthetic storytelling of our film. You could say the NT is one of our strongest characters. Well, one of the strongest supporting characters. Guess who's the lead? I also co-wrote it. My name's Steve Grogan. Been a location scout for about 20 years. I'm known in the industry as a bit of a lone wolf. A bit of a maverick. Off to Europe, eh? No, just Darwin. <laughs> Via Europe. This time they've saddled me up with an assistant. A young indigenous bloke named Morgan. Where are you, lad? Call sheet said 0800. Just behind you. Say. I guess I took the job because, I don't know, it kind of just landed in my lap and I just kind of needed a break from, you know, whatever. Pretty cute car. Not cute, it's tough. That's nice spacious though. Was to you shove seven suitcases into it? We start shooting our movie in about three weeks' time. So between now and then, Steve and Morgan still have to secure over 100 locations in Kakadu, Catherine, Darwin and the Tiwi Islands. This work is gruelling and the terrain unrelenting. Let's just be clear about this. We are going to be roughing it. We're going to be working in some of the harshest conditions known to man. You got that? I've got each of you staying in your own King Deluxe suite with breakfast included and free access to the spa, sauna and gym. Here are your room keys. Oh, I'm a simple bloke. Give me a swag on the sand any day of the week. Unlike Morgan's generation who think they're entitled to some kind of celebrity lifestyle. Just want to laze around like they're bloody Susan Sarandon. Oi! This ain't no holiday. Oh, it's a bit like a holiday. It's nothing like a holiday. We're here to work. What kind of work? All sorts of shit. We find picturesque locations and, and drive around those picturesque locations and photograph those picturesque Locations. Sounds a bit like a holiday. It's nothing like a holiday, and I should know. Been doing this gig for 20 years and never had a holiday yet. Be a man. Thanks, Bill. Can I get a mango daiquiri? Thank you. <sighs> so what's on for today? Well, we've got a full plate. Full plate of what? You've got to fill it a flat out, two struggle sausages, and a side of under the pump. Where the fuck have you been? Call sheet said 0700 hours. Sorry, what happened again? Well, it better not. I've already had three breakfast. Keep this up on fucking gout by the end of the week. This shit won't fly when production comes to town now, mate. You'll have the producers to answer to. It's time to show Morgan that location scouting is no picnic. No piece of cake. No walk in the park. It was literally all of those things. That was just a coincidence. A big part of the gig is sending location shots to the director, because you want to show that the location works cinematically. Here's a look. I put a lot of time and effort into making sure that my location photos are perfect. Yeah, not bad. What'd you get? A deconstructed Caesar salad. Oh. What if they make a deconstructed meat pie? A deconstructed meat pie? Yeah. What would that be? A dead rat in a pile of flour? Oh, maggot gravy in a plastic bag. Two pig's ankles and a sheep's asshole. Uh -huh. You gonna eat that thing or just take 17 photos of it? Where's my swag? I don't know, maybe the tide? It's a pool you fucking hit yet. That's my swag. Why'd you take my swag? Sorry, sir. We can't just let people camp around the resort pool. Oh, for a starter, I'm not people. I'm a person. Now, why don't you show a bit of initiative and make an exception, you muppet? If you're not happy with the room, perhaps we can upgrade you to the six-star senator's suite. This is a stitch-up. Steve, there is a Schmick Hotel on our locations list. G'day. Steve Grogan. We're here on behalf of the feature film, Top End Wedding. I was wondering if I could speak to the manager, please, about a film permit. Go ahead. You gonna get him? I'm the manager. I see. Fuck. It's gonna be a really long six weeks. Mm -hmm.